guys, my name is Rock here. What is going on guys, my name is Adam AFD and welcome back to Sonic Central Multiplayer Sunday. So today we're going to be continuing Sonic 3 Knuckles. And yeah, this is Ice Cap Zone and it actually I think they've changed the background a little for this. It looks uh, a little darker. I think. Yeah, and the uh, parallax scrolling looks really good. Yeah, there's like way more layers. But yeah, um, if you haven't, if you played Sonic Adventure 5, you probably realised that there's a snowboarding section on that game. Well, it actually originated from this game. And it plays really well. Yeah. I just wish it was a little longer, you know? Yeah. <laughs> you just got crushed right there. Yep. Um, but yeah, as for Ice Cup Zone, this is actually one of the best zones in the game, in my opinion. Yeah, the, the music is so key. Yeah, the music is really good. And if you actually look in the background, there is so much going on. Yeah. It's got like two different backgrounds if you actually look. Yeah, this is supposed to be the place in Sonic Adventure. Yeah, um, I, yeah. I think it's just a whole other section, actually. Yeah. Like in Sonic Adventure, you like, obviously can't get there. Because uh, it is all on Angel Island, I think. Or is yeah, the Ice Cup a... Zone on Angel. Wait, hold on. On Sonic Adventure, why are you on Angel Island when you go into the Ice Cup Zone? I yeah. think you are, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, but Angel Island looks absolutely tiny on Sonic Adventure. Yeah, I don't know why. Yeah. It's just obviously because of the Dreamcast capabilities. I'm pretty sure if they ever put Angel Island on like a PS4 and Xbox One, it would be like massive. That would be so awesome if they could bring that back. It would be a little like weird if they brought Ice Cup Zone back because we've already done it in Sonic 3 and we've also got it in yeah. Sonic Adventure. But um, it would be nice for them to see like old locations again. Yeah, but this this level itself is really easy. Like the only the only difficult thing about this level is um, accidentally getting crushed by those like you know those things. I don't know what they are. Yeah. Or the last bot or the boss. The yeah where he freezes. But if you've you, got Super Sonic, it's really easy. Yeah. Uh, or someone to play as Tails as well. Yeah. I really am liking the fact that the Super Sonic music is gone. It's just a sped up uh, Ice Cap music. Yeah. They just they just yeah. Because the thing is with that is that the music got so repetitive. Yeah, and what's also like, cause the like if they speed the music up, it's always going to be different. Yeah, like you're not going to be listening to the, the same loop over and over again. I mean, you are, but it's not going to last as long. Plus, if you turn to Supersonic early on, you're not going to actually hear the level music at yeah. all. Exactly. And that's that. Honestly, it's even worse with Sonic and Knuckles because that music gets a little too much. I like, I prefer the Sonic Three theme to the Sonic and Knuckles theme. Yeah, that's much a, it's a lot better. Yeah, yeah. After this one, we will be doing launch base and finishing the Sonic 3 section off. Yeah. And right, let's just... What the hell? Why is he going that way? Um, hold on, dude. Let me just see if I can just push this. Um, oh. That was obviously going <laughs> to happen. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what the hell that was. Um, so I won't actually push it. I'm just going to leave you to push no, it. I'll, I'll just push it, yeah. Yeah. I think I'll just... All right. Come on. All right. I'll just jump to the top of this. Uh, but this bit, I think the amount of times we got crushed by this bit... Oh, crap. Oh, no. Um, oh, we're gonna have to take that again. Yeah. But yeah, the I amount of times we'll just fall off and get room. crushed. Yeah. Yeah, because I don't know why I just stood on the end of it then. That was obviously gonna happen. Yeah, this bit is really glitchy with tails. I think it is anyway, from what I remember. Oh, there oh. you go. <laughs> now, that was actually my fault. He's a spin dash, so. Yeah. Which is actually really cute. Like, I wonder why tails can't do the spin dash anymore. Yeah, I know he used to be able to do that. Yeah, like, well, to be fair, he was never able to do it on any game past 3D ones. No, what, couldn't he do the spin Wait, dash on Sonic R? Um, I think he could. But so could, could he? I don't know. I can't remember. Hold on, could he do the spin dash on Sonic 2? Yeah? Yeah. He could only do it on the classic games. Yeah, exactly. Like, and Knuckles when, could do it as well. Yeah, when it got to Sonic Adventure, he couldn't do it. I wonder if they can still do it, they just don't do it. I don't know. It's, it's, it's probably They've probably changed it to Sonic, like a Sonic only thing, you know? Yeah, because think of it, like, what makes Sonic unique in the classic games if they can both, if everyone can do the spin dash? Yeah. Like, it's just already the insta shield, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, but this boss is pretty easy, especially if you have Super Sonic. And yeah. even then, it's just it's just really just the Metropolis boss. Oh, yeah, it is, yeah. Yeah, and it's also on Sonic 4. And that yeah. boss is actually really annoying, that Metropolis one. That one is annoying, yeah. Because yeah. you don't have the insta shield, you have to kind I mean, of... If you've got someone playing as Tails with you or Super Sonic, it's easy. But if you're just playing as Sonic on, on his own, it could be annoying. Yeah, it's just like... like Without the insta shield, you just kind of have to take a, a lucky chance and hope yeah. you actually uh, destroy one of those things. Yeah, that. but with Act 2, we're actually outside now. Hold on, we are outside at the end of Act 1, and then we just finally get to go back uh, outside. But actually, in Act 2, you can actually go back inside the... Um, I think it's a cave, isn't it? It's like a cavern. Yeah, it's like a cavern. Um, but yeah, that just kind of proves how... Or just an ice cap. <laughs> or just... A, yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this just proves how much detail they put into this game. Yeah. I'm actually really looking forward to seeing uh, how it plays out on a uh, Sonic the end of launch phase because yeah. it is Sonic 3 complete. I want to see if they've added like any new like cutscenes and because if, if we actually go against the big arm boss. Yeah, because if you play Sonic 3 and Knuckles, you just defeat that 
Ah, uh, I don't know the name of the, the first, first, the first yeah, one. Yeah, I don't know the name of that. But just but think about it, there's three bosses in the original Sonic 3 launch base. Yeah. Three bosses for Jesus. Crazy. Well, actually, four, isn't there? Oh, yeah, there is. the sub-boss yeah. on Act yeah. 1. That's Jesus, crazy. That's inc that is insane. But funny enough, they're all e really easy bosses. They are so easy, like, yeah. Big yeah. arms used to be annoying when we were kids, but that... We don't think we really know about the Insta Shield there. Yeah, even you, then you, you don't even really need the Insta Shield now. You just I don't know. Yeah, if you've done the boss so many times, it just becomes really easy. I'm just hoping that maybe if when we get onto it with Supersonic, uh, when he attacks you, Supersonic doesn't actually get hurt. Yeah, because that was always a weird glitch with that boss. If you're Supersonic, you you get hurt. It's weird. All right. Oh God, no. Oh no. Okay, I can turn Supersonic. Oh, what the? Oh no. All right, just hold on, was here. hold on, wait a second. Was that working then, or no? It wasn't. For some reason, it wasn't responding properly. It's, that's weird. X and C, isn't it? Ah, oh. so. oh. never mind. That is annoying. Yeah. Oh, well, this honestly, this act is not is not that long. Nah. And actually, this war this actually zone features water as well. But honestly, oh, yeah, the does. water isn't that tedious in this zone. It's not like you're gonna drown, because uh, if you go into the water on this zone, you're actually gonna die. Because it leads straight into a pitfall, doesn't it? Yeah, exactly. I think even that, even Tails. Oh no, Tails would be able to get out of it. So would Knuckles. If you just Sonic, it's screwed, basically. If Dude, I'll just that. like speed run through this. Okay, sure. That's that's cool, man. It just makes it a little faster. Yeah. Don't want to stick in one level for too long, you know. Yeah. Also, it's just I'm so happy we've got all the emeralds already. Exactly. Because honestly, I don't. I, wait, hold on a sec. I, don't, I think I only know where one emerald is in this entire Act Two. Yeah, it's, it's in like, the water, isn't it? Yeah, it's it? like in the water in a wall or something. To the. Uh, the right. Yeah, the right, yeah. Or the left, it's one of them. Yeah, it's All I know is yeah. it's underwater, and that, that's the only one I know. In fact, after we've actually finished this side, I'll be playing as Tails from Sonic and Knuckles. Yeah. Oh, those Emerald Stages, though. Sonic and Knuckles Emerald Stages are... They're, they are... They're, they're decent. They're, they're not they're, no, they're terribly easy. hard. They just it's just confusing at times. Yeah, they're like can... a lot more challenging, and they really challenge your mind um, rather than Sonic 3's. I think it's all down to the, you know, those like golden spheres where they bounce yeah, around. Yeah, they, they um, really come into play. I know there's one when it requires you to like quickly um, bounce off a star one and then quickly turn. Jump. Yeah, it's 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 really confusing. Yeah, if if that's like your first time playing, you are you have no doubt gonna screw up. Exactly, because it's just you just don't expect uh, stuff like that. I right. think up there there was loads of rings, but I don't think you need them because you got. 119. Yeah, I'm sure we're coming to the end of this this act anyway. Yeah, yeah, there we go. So this is this dude's gonna be a walk in the park because Adam Supersonic and all right, yeah. got into a good position right there. This boss is honestly, it's, it's like it's not really hard. You just forget the pattern sometimes. Yeah, but look, done already though, you know. Yeah. But yeah, Ice Cap's one of the best zones. Hey, look, have you seen that behind the two? They've added a little. Uh, oh yeah, there's like yeah. a snowflake there. Hold on, what is it usually? Is it just those Sonics that? I think it, I'm, normally it's that little pattern, isn't it? Oh, I think behind so. Yeah. Two's, yeah. Yeah. Dude, this Sonic 3 complete is just excellent. Yeah, that's, so why we, that's why we did this one. Is it just it, this is really what Sonic 3, you know, could have been like yeah. fully. Like this dude's basically just added a lot of things into it and fixed glitches and whatnot. But there is a ring. Sonic down here. 3 released around February, didn't it? 1994. I think so. And then Sonic and Knuckles. I think it released November or September. It was one of them. Yeah. Um. Honestly, I would have just like. I would have, if like, uh, we were obviously born in 1994, but if I was a lot older then, I wouldn't have minded that uh, several month wait just to get like the full uh, Yeah, but I don't think anyone would have known though. Yeah, I mean, probably Sonic and Knuckles probably wasn't even announced until like later on in 1994. Yeah, I mean, like, people wouldn't have known it was just an add-on for Sonic 3. Oh yeah, true. They would have found that out when they bought the game. Yeah. That whole, that whole lock-on technology was so damn good for its time. Yeah. Like the fact that you can get like several games out of just two. Ah, oh, that ain't gonna work. Yeah. So hopefully you don't actually run out of rings on this. Yeah, because that, that would be annoying. But the thing is, the boss isn't really that hard, so if I run out of rings just before the end, uh, you know, yeah, you can just take him out, can't you? Yeah, I can take it. Honestly, it's a lot harder with Knuckles, dude, because he actually has two of them. Oh, yeah, he's got to take out two of them. And guys. his jump is really low, so... Yeah, you just got to make sure you have a load of rings or you can turn into Super Knuckles or something. But Super Knuckles isn't too great in this game, it's just Knuckles. Yeah, I remember when we, when we first got Sonic Heroes, like, when they all turned to their super forms at the end, we were expecting, like, a bit more. Yeah. You know, like, Knuckles and Tails just they're get just in a weird, weird thing, yeah. Sonic gets, like, the, the really good part. Like, I was expecting to see, like, Flickies in that. Honestly, Tails. Sonic Team are just not that good when it comes to, like, um, I don't know, they, they ex if you played the classic games before Sonic Heroes, like me and Adam did, that was their super forms. Yeah, like we were expecting it. to see Sonic 3 super forms, but like they're just completely different. It doesn't actually make any sense. 
Just shows you that it's just awesome how every single character do does have a super form. Yeah, exactly. Well, wait, does well? No, I mean they all are capable. Yeah, of exactly. Super I wonder what like SPOs would look like. Yeah, yeah, that that was pretty. That would be pretty interesting actually. Because like Sonic's spikes go upwards, don't they? But like yeah. no one else's change at all. Right, I just want to try and get loads of these. Oh, they're nice. Oh, 61, nice. Yeah. Uh, here's something as well. Like, on Sonic Boom, because uh, we are just talking about those spikes, Shadow Spikes are actually just Sonics. Like, they don't... They're not kind of Super Sonic-like, if that makes sense. Oh, yeah. On Sonic Boom, he just looks like Sonic. A recolor. It's just... Yeah, he just looks like a recolor of Sonic. It's weird. <laughs> like those people who just recolor Sonic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fan characters. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, that's for Sonic Boom. That's a whole different story. Um, this is confusing, this level, seriously. Yeah. Like, I mean, I used to be really good with this level, but now it's, like, really confusing. I know, exactly, dude. Um, there are some times where, like, I'd be able to, like, blast through this entire zone, but for some reason, as, as of late, I'd just, like, get lost in it. It's weird. You know what I think it is? It's because when you see Sonic, you'll run up, like, you'll run up hills and stuff that you're supposed to actually go down. Yeah. So you'll end up just going back, going in circles. Ah, oh, why did I jump it's down? Just, it's just this, like, for example, I've never been here before. <laughs> Because yeah. we're, we're always so used to sticking to one diff like one route. You I know? always know when it's the end, though, because you go through, like, loads of different pipes. Yeah. I, was, I always know what that's I always the remember end that, yeah. It's cool how they just leave memorable things like that. Yeah. I'm sure we are supposed to be going this way. Yeah, we probably are. It's always stick to the right, you know? And I uh, love the, the sprite change right there. Yeah. It's just not golden, uh, normal Sonic or whatever. I'm sure the boss... Uh, I always remember this. When we come down here now, I'm sure the boss... Ah, oh, what the hell? Just keep going right, dude. I'm sure it's the right way. But launch base is really interesting. Like, it's like usually at the end of Sonic 1, it was like a metallic base. End of Sonic 2, it was Death Egg, obviously. That's still a lot of metallic, but... As for launch base, it's like... It's like different, isn't it? Yeah. It's not like... Yeah, I'm glad it wasn't just a generic last stage. Yeah, exactly. It was, like, really unique. But then when Sonic and Knuckles comes into it... The like, first proper... The last proper level in Sonic 3 and Knuckles is Death Egg. Yeah. Like, Doomsday is more of just a... Like, just a boss zone. Egg, it's kind of like, like how you got Final Zone. zone you know, it? you got Final Zone on yeah. Sonic the Hedgehog 1. It's just kind of like that. Scrap Rain's the true last level in... Oh, true, yeah. And, yeah, you know, that's true. it's just a boss stage. And we just ran out of rings. What the hell? Oh, crap. That was going to happen, yeah. Uh, oh, we've got fine. a bubble, though. And you just take... You just even take them out. Yeah. Uh, the good thing about tails is that his propeller, like his, I'm gonna call them propellers. I know they're just his tails, but they are kind of like a helicopter. But um, yeah. they can actually harm enemies, Aww. which is really cool. First hit, I try and take. I think you bring her. Yeah. <laughs> right, let's come up here. Okay. Right, I'm gonna do all I can on this act to not even. I'll try and turn to supersonic more later on. Yeah. Um, because of the last boss. Oh, and also that robotics. You know when uh, Sonic takes control of Eggman's Eggmobile. <laughs> Oh yeah, and then yeah, and you've that still got your super form. Ages. And from what I remember, when we used to do co-op on this game like years ago, tails won't actually spawn in the last boss. I don't know why. Yeah, just... I wish maybe they've changed it on I this. I hope so because um, that always confused me. That did. And the fact that tails doesn't spawn on the last boss is just weird. Oh man, that dude always gets me. I don't know yeah. why. I always, I always, some for some reason jump there. No matter how many times that dude gets yeah. me. I wish kind of would always remember it. I always just remember to insta shield or something. Yeah. But if you had supersonic there, it'd be different, but I don't think there's 50 rings. Yeah. But as you can see, we're actually in the sky right now, and actually what's really cool about, um, towards the end of this zone is that, um, the Death Egg takes off with you actually, um, flying towards it, and you can see that the, the, the zone going in the sky, it's really cool. Yeah. Oh, well, God damn it! why did we just do that? I don't know, man. Because <laughs> I, I completely forget that these things get you loads of rings. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's loads, but seriously, there is. Yeah. I know there's one section where it goes, like, on for a lot longer, and there's, yeah, and there is loads. There's loads, yeah. Hopefully, you can get a shield because that can actually just. Uh, I don't know whether to go in or not. Yeah, just yeah, go and screw it. Oh, not this one. Yeah, this one is. Uh, it's just kind of one where you like might as well fail it because I don't really know what you can get out of this. It's like um, I mean, you can kind of get like the gumball things. I knew I was gonna fail that. Yeah. But hopefully, we can get the gumball one later. If you, if, well, if we do go into one later on. Yeah, because that is the best one. You get so much out of it. That's this is the the normal Sonic Three one. Yeah, like that that and that other one were the ones from Sonic Three, aren't they? Huh? That you know that one we just went in that yeah. Gumball one and that one are the ones from Sonic Three. They're, no, they're from Sonic and Knuckles. Oh really? Yeah. What? Dun, 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 that's from Sonic dun, dun, and Knuckles. All oh, right. Yeah, there's only one special. There's only one bonus stage in Sonic Three, and that's that ah, Gumball. Right. Yeah. 
the best one then. Yeah, I don't like the Sonic and Knuckles bonus stages at all. Yeah, and I mean that sort of pinball. It's one okay. Yeah. yeah. The only thing I hate one. Yeah, the only thing I hate about that is that um when you lose your freaking rings from yeah. Egg well, Man. that happens on Sonic Two, doesn't it? But that's yeah. But it's still yeah. annoying. But another thing I hate is that the um you know the the outer edge of the zone, they all turn into those goals eventually. Oh god. All right, you're we're not going to be careful here. I'm gonna try. Oh no, I missed. Right, can you even kill this? Oh no. You can't kill him until his mouth's open. Oh boy. All right, one dodge this dude. All right, cool. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, that's fine. I want to avoid this laser. Nice. Nice. See, that's if that just was how a, good it is. Yeah, if that was the original Sonic 3 game, you would have turned oh, Super Sonic. I always forget that little spring comes in there. I swear I thought oh, we no, were going to run into this spikes. It's crazy. I wonder if that's Sanopolis in the background. Kind of looks like it, doesn't it? It's yeah. Like Egyptian, uh, yeah. I mean, you never know. I mean, it does take you downwards after you've done this, so. Yeah. It's just so hard to believe this entire game takes place on just Angel Island. To be fair, though, Lee, yeah, Sonic is on the flying battery, and then Sanopolis, like, the flying battery must. That's what I've never understood. It's like Angel Island must be massive considering he's on a big ship. And he's still on. Yeah, and he still ends up being on it's Angel like, Island. It's like Angel Island seems like a, a world. It's just never ending. Yeah, it, it seems like it's its own thing, but it's just a floating island, but it's gigantic. Right? And of course, the only inhabitant on the entire yeah. thing. <laughs> yeah. And his favourite food's grapes. So, where did you find grapes? Yeah, exactly. And There's only a one, like, two grassy areas in the entire of Angel Island from what we've seen. Well, there could be more, but we just don't see them. Yeah. Like, um. Actually, no, Mystic Ruins isn't on Angel Island, is it? Sorry. No, it isn't. Crash, Angel Island crashes into Mystic Ruins or something. Yeah. It's something like that. But it would be so awesome to see an HD Angel Island thing. Yeah, that'd be cool. Finally bring it back. Ah, oh, we lost the shield. It's a good job I didn't insta shield then. I was, I was about to do that. Yeah. Just think of how much, like, new things they could write for Sonic. Like, uh, lately it just seems like they're just trying to think of entirely new, new ideas. Now, what it feels like they're trying to do is they're trying to make Sonic, like, uh, how it was in the 90, like, 92, yeah, you know, with, like, the yeah. flickies and all that. I mean, I know they had the flickies in, like, I don't know, it's just something about the way they're, they're like, making the trees look, and it, it's just... I don't understand the trees in Sonic Lost World. Why are they all square? Yeah. Reminds me of, like, Canada on South Park. Yeah. <laughs> no, it kind of seems like they're just trying to take a Super Mario direction. I don't know why. But yeah. They just seriously get back to, like, some older things, like Angel Island. They, they, they I mean, Sonic was, Sonic was up continuity. working well in... Colors and generations, but then yeah. they do one new idea and then it tends to fail. That's what they always try to do. Like Sonic and Leash, I love Sonic and Leash, yeah, but that is considered game. to be like a bad game. I don't see how. I honestly and don't they see tried a new wrong. formula, but then they improved upon it on Sonic Colors and Generations. But I actually think Unleashed is better yeah, than, I, yeah, than 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 uh, Colors and Generations. Yeah, anyway. me too, man. Generations yeah. is a great game, but it seems like it was really easy to write. Yeah, because it's yeah, it's, just go through all the zones and like the the. Plot for it's really lack. I don't really it's not consider it to be like a major title. It doesn't seem like a major game, game at all. No, like the last major Sonic title, obviously, is Sonic Lost World. But before that was Colors, and then it was Unleashed. So that has. I would say Sonic Boom's major. It kind of is. It's different series, isn't it? If that yeah. makes sense. Yeah. They but, they um, can still do loads of Sonic series, and I just look forward to what they do with it. There's like endless things they can do with it. Yeah. But honestly, like the only thing I want is I just want them to bring old things back, like uh, Angel Island. I don't want any 2D sections or anything like that. In terms of plot, yeah, I just want no 2D kind of sections. Old, because nah, no 2D just, sections. That's just they're trying to be too nostalgic and that. And it's like 2D sections only exist, but existed back here because they couldn't do 3D games yeah, because exactly. of the, you know, the capabilities. Exactly, yeah. So there's no point in trying to bring it back. The way it kind of seems, it seems like uh, the everyone loves the classic games. There's no like you know no denying that. There's no denying that. And they think just because everyone loves the classic games, they're in 2D. Everyone's gonna love the modern games if they put them in 2D. But yeah. That's got absolutely nothing to do with it. Honestly, what makes these games so amazing is just the zones and all that. The, yeah, know, all that the level, the, the just smart level design. Yeah, just the atmosphere like of it. But yeah, this boss is pretty easy. Oh, you can't glitch over. Yeah, it. they've yeah, there's a they've put a barrier here, so I can't actually jump over. That's weird. I, mean, I suppose that's pretty cool. That's because really that's how it should have been. But yeah, exactly. I'll just avoid him right. When now. you think about it, how could they like screw that up? Oh sh crap! Yeah. All right, let me just turn to him. I don't want to get hurt. Oh man, I, oh cool, I went out my super form. Oh yeah, nice. <laughs> you died. You see that? That was a splash. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, this this is what normally happens. But we'll be super, we'd be normally be super sonic, but they fixed it. Oh. That is really cool. Yeah. But what normally happens is, I always die, like, when me and Adam used to play co-op, like, years ago, I'd always, or he would always die there. I think he used to always play yeah. Tails. 
Um, Tails, I, I remember us having Tails in the boss fight. Yeah, we managed one. to get him there once. Dude, I've just realised why Knuckles falls off that. Because the, the pressure from the Death Egg launch yeah. makes him fall off. Yeah. I've never under... I've only just realised that. Seriously, look at this detail. If you actually look gradually, the Death Egg is taking off. Yeah, oh. look at the flame. Oh, it's just fantastic, seriously. Yeah. They really outdid themselves with these games. Okay, this thing's attached to the Death Egg, isn't it? Uh, yeah. How exactly does Sonic defeating it somehow cause it to fall down? I mean, uh, he just probably exactly sets it on fire or something. It just oh, 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 the the fire from the machine when he blows yeah, it up. Yeah, it probably just burns off this little attachment to it. That was so, that is ridiculous. Right, dude, easy. I want to, uh, you know, because we're super something now. I actually want to try something. When that crazy uh, no, big arms grabs me. Oh yeah, let's. I want to see if it actually hurts me. It was, I can't really defeat this dude. I can't defeat this dude without any rings. Yeah. It's easy. I just want to see if he's fixed it. All right, let's see this. Oh, oh wow. No. Okay then. That's cool. Yeah, and also made yeah. the, the spring noise. Spring noise. It? That's so cool. Yeah. That's how it should have been in the first Honestly, place. Honestly, this seems like um the this is probably the best possible version of Sonic 3, without a doubt. Honestly, if this was on a, a cartridge, if they've added anything Christ. after this, it's going to be incredible. Yeah. Honestly, just but this boss has got such badass music. Incredible uh, music. Hold on, this music used at the end of Sonic and Knuckles, isn't it? The um the, that big fingers boss or whatever it is. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, that's such, such yeah, a good that boss is fight. So good. Oh crap. Oh, won't get hurt anyway, will you? No. <laughs> cool. We're actually running low on rings, actually. Yeah, we are. I don't think we're too far off it though. Uh, from what I remember, this boss doesn't take too many hits. Yeah, he's probably got about one or two left. Yeah. Uh oh. God, we've almost been on this level not in a minute. The oh nice. Nothing. That was good. Yeah. All yeah. right, let's see this now. Boom. Yeah, nice. Done. Yeah, so that boss is pretty easy. With standard Sonics, it's even still easy yeah. as well. I just want to see if that's different. Alright, let's just... Uh, I just want to see if it doesn't just take us down. I want to see if they've added anything different to it. Yeah. Because do we normally see the Death Egg falling on the three No, and usually it just... Like, right now it will... It should take us to the right. Like, it would usually just fade off. Like, Sonic would just go out of screen. So it's actually doing the Sonic... And Sonic 3 ending. Sonic 3 ending, yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Whoa, 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 what? Oh, oh wow. man, that is so badass. Sonic, Sonic Knuckles title screen. So cool.